Um, I'm back from a, a long thought of since my last vlog. And I had a, like a thought where it's like we're almost as people constantly looking for some kind of approval. And for me, it was always trying to prove everything to everyone, whoever said awful things to me, like I wasn't going to amount to anything and I was fat or ugly or like no one loves me and I'm an asshole or a piece of shit. So if made me focused more on improving those things like I wasn't going to amount to anything so I try hard to be something to be someone I wanted to be some something big that's art related like being an like an art teacher or a game designer or something and being called fat it made me want to focus on working out all the time and left me so tired and weak I didn't do anything throughout the day or being called ugly and constantly trying to figure out ways to make myself look more attractive or something along the lines of that or being mounted to anything and all I want to do is be something and be someone and I've been called that and left by that and so it made me believe that's all I am and that's it's scarred in me, in my mind, in my heart, that I'm nothing but all those things. So I try so hard to be something more than what they call me. And as much as people say, the strong people say, that it doesn't bother them, it doesn't hurt, and it does hurt. And it hurts our self-esteem, it hurts our way of being. It makes us stop to be ourselves. So we're constantly looking for approval. And for me, it was to prove all those people wrong, to prove my dad that I was going to be something, to prove my mom that I'm not all those things. And I'm going to be something. I'm going to be someone. And that happens to be Mr. Reaper. That happens to be me today. And I know it's something that she's not happy with or approve of, but... I'm happy being me right now and it's a struggle because it's constantly fighting with myself of I'm happy the way I am now but it's not the me that my mom thought I was going to be so I'm not happy with myself but I'm happy with myself if you understand you're constantly fighting with yourself and I know I'm not the only one there's people out there like that too and it's hard and it's stressful and depressing and confusing and it hurts and so it's like as if we're constantly looking for approval. And we just want to be heard. We want to feel love. We want to feel as if we're wanted and we're not just pieces of shit. We're not just assholes. We're not ugly or fat because everyone's beautiful in different ways. Everybody's strong in different ways. We all have our own goals and we all have our own things. Sometimes it's hard for us to see it that way or to believe it or to want it. Like I said, sometimes we're just left feeling that way and scarred that way. So I have a hard time believing that way. And for my last vlog, and yes, I got into a disagreement with my mom. We had a fight. And... It made me very depressed for like a few days well, since the vlog and even bef the few days before that vlog. And I didn't know what to do with myself. I didn't know where to go or what to do, just lost. So I took days away. I just fell into a small depression a little bit because I don't know what to do anymore. I 
try my best it's, and it doesn't seem to be good enough for her or anyone. So I say fuck it. Fuck them. Fuck her. I'm going to do me. I don't need anybody's fucking approval because I'm a fucking rebel and I'm a fucking dude in a mask sitting in his fucking bathroom floor making sure you guys know that I'm not fucking dead or I didn't commit suicide or you know it's like oh did that positive dude finally reach rock bottom be like fuck no fuck you mom fucking calling me down saying uh no one's gonna fucking your guys are fucking better off without me and shit I'm gonna hide my siblings away from me and fucking just because I don't want to take fucking pills and shit um I'm perfectly fine I'm still alive and breathing not only I'm helping myself I'm helping other people well I'm trying anyway and I'm pretty fucking proud of myself that I got this far and being 22 years old and still breathing to this day that I didn't fucking put a bullet through my head yet amount of shit I've been through I say I'm pretty fucking proud of it and you're like the last person I need approval from. And that goes for everybody out there who's seeking out some kind of approval and that they feel depressed, that they have to prove themselves to anybody. Fuck them. Constantly do you no matter what. Fucking wear makeup. Fucking wear your nail polish. Wear your fucking rugged ass clothes. Just do you. If you're comfortable being you, who the fuck should stop you from being you? Now don't think that like oh i have a job that means i can be me on the job no no just outside the job or outside of certain places that you know you can't really like go all crazy and overboard on like certain public places if just re be respectful and you know don't get yourself fired or uh kicked out of somewhere but outside the house or inside your house or just you should always be you no matter what fuck their approvals Fuck your boyfriend's approvals. Fuck your girlfriend's approvals. Your boyfriend fucking tells you, oh, I don't like how your fucking hair is shaved on the side or you have all these piercings on your face. Fuck him. You can leave his fucking ass because fuck his approval. Who the fuck is he? And your girlfriend's constantly holding you back from having a fucking good time with your bros because she doesn't like one of them or whatever. Fuck her approval too. You live once. Enjoy your youth. Don't let it fucking let somebody else stop you from being your own individual do you who the fuck are they they're fucking human they bleed just like you why should they have a leash over you your parents i mean don't go overboard and crazy obviously respect your parents and love them and care as much as they care and love you but if your mom or dad's telling you like oh son don't wear your fucking makeup don't put that dress on you're not a girl fucking be you anyway if you believe you're like a girl and transgender and shit, be you. Or if you're a guy trying to be a girl or a girl trying to be a guy and your parents are stopping you from be you being you, fuck their approval. It's your life. No one else is like should matter of their opinions on what you're doing. Unless it's life or death. Other than that, if you don't have a fucking gun to your head and saying, hey mom, I'm going to be... A girl from now on and she's like no son you can't be you're not gonna blow your fucking brains out you're gonna fight for your right for your individual always be you that goes for my fucking own family too my mom my brothers my fucking dad whoever <laughs> this is me you don't like how I dress you don't like how I wear my makeup you don't like how I put my face paint on or I walk around with my mask on this is a symbol Anybody that sees me with this mask to come over and give me a fucking hug or I'll give you a fucking hug or advice or even someone to talk to. I'm going to push you for who you should be. I'm going to encourage you of who you want to be. I ain't going to slow you down. This is a symbol for us to be ourselves and just push to love each other. Because right now this world's too fucking dry of it and we need a little more love in this world. So thank you for watching if you stuck through this whole 10 minutes of this, but I need to get this out and I'm so fucking fed up with parents 
your boyfriends, your girlfriends, your fucking exes, your friends stopping you from being you, fuck them. If you have to, just leave them because they ain't fucking worth it. If they can't love you for you, then they're loving something that they want you to be. Like your boyfriends are telling you, hey, I don't like you to have like this color hair. Keep it blonde, but you want to fucking have blue wicked hair. But they they want to have you as a trophy girlfriend. They like, oh, I have a, a blonde girlfriend or even guys. Your girlfriend's like, oh, I want you to be athletic and built and stuff. But that's stopping you from enjoying your fucking Big Macs and shit. Fuck them. Eat your goddamn Big Macs. Dye your fucking hair. Fuck them. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching and all that fucking like subscribe bullshit that you, you know, honestly I don't even give a shit if you guys do I'm fucking making these if I want to if I want to who the fuck are you to tell me I can't make my fucking video and I'm just playing but always uh, I'm there to talk to you if you need to on Facebook is uh, Chase Weeper or PSN is Mr. Dash Weeper and just always be you Stop playing these games because you only live once. It's your life. No one should stop you from being you.